Well, there's nothing like heading down to the beach and catching a bite to eat on the water. But after seeing rodents, roaches, sewage leaks, and food at hazardous temperatures on the inspection reports, you might lose your appetite. However, this popular hangout, now a dirty dining, claims to have new management in charge, and things are now changing. It was amazing. It was really good. It was wonderful. Elisa Fish and Dennis Reed just ate at PCI Bar and Grill inside the Postcard Inn Hotel on St. Pete Beach, and clearly they're big fans. I actually had the PCI salad okay. to die for. I had a fantastic salmon sandwich. It was a special of the day. It was awesome. Awesome. Not so awesome? The recent inspections. This prime beachfront location had unwelcome visitors that included rodents. Is there a manager I can talk to? On February 5th, inspectors found dozens of rodent droppings all over the dry storage area and near the bar and produce cooler. Also not pleasing to the palate, sewage backing up through the floor drains, with employees tracking the wastewater throughout the restaurant. In regards to your uh, food inspections. And just a week before that, PCI had to throw out several gallons of cheese sauce and chili because they could have made customers sick. This after facing two other stop sales in 2013 for improper food temperatures and moldy potatoes. Are you the manager? Yeah. Hotel General Manager Paul Herbert says he was actually hired in June to turn the place around. We um, have replaced the food and beverage director and we made a lot of changes to the operation to improve the safety of the food and quality of the food to make sure our guests have a good experience. And it's a big undertaking. Inspectors found more than 120 violations over the last year, including more rodent activity and live roaches. We take this all very serious that we're trying to make the changes and to make the improvements. Um, always trying to learn and make the place a better establishment. It might be working. Both Dennis and Alicia are coming back. Absolutely. I come back all the time. This is somewhere that I would go back to definitely. PCI Bar and Grill also issued a written statement which says in part, quote, in the past year, our ownership has invested over 1.5 million in improvements to the property and restaurant space. The recent violations referenced in the report have been corrected. To read PCI's full response and to see other dirty dining stories, head to our website at abcactionnews.com. And if you have a tip on a dirty restaurant, head to my Facebook fan page under Wendy Ryan, WFTS, like my page and send me a note.